Hey beauties, it's review time. Stay tuned. <laughs> Everybody knows this pattern, right? Everybody knows that. It's like eight out of ten people know what that is. So I was on Amazon and I got this. These are some eyelashes. And you guys know, but if you know, I recently started to really experiment with eyelashes and you know, you know, normally I'll try the Sephora, I tried, you know, the $2 brands or whatever you gonna call it. But today I'm gonna try right out the box. I already took it out the plastic, so it was like real, very protected. And let's see, let's open it up, guys. Oh my gosh, look at that! It's more than one. I thought it was only one in there. So when I originally purchased this, I thought that it was only gonna be one for about $15. So I was already like, oh my gosh, that's super expensive. These have to be like mink eyelashes. But you know what? I like it. All right, guys, I'm back. So let's see. Let's open them up again. It's like when you just open it, it's like, oh, it's so beautiful. Look at that. Now, I was at a store. And I saw a whole bunch of eyelashes, and this one was like just like three dollars for the pack. But I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna look at these. So look at this quality, right? These are the ones that I got from like a regular clothing store. And look at this. That's so amazing. It's like I don't even want to open them. They look so pretty. All right, look at them. All right, let's see. And you know the thing I love about this? The thing I love about this right off the bat, right off the bat, is that it has, you guys are like, what's in that box? It comes with its very own sets of teasers. Look at that. Not even one. For 15, 31, I think it was, somewhere around there. It has one, two, three types of tweezers for you to put these eyelashes on. The only thing it does not come with is the glue. And I really wish it did come with the glue because that would have made it so much easier. But you know what? It's not bad. We'll get glue anywhere. All right. And now the box is empty. I cleared it out. So you guys probably missed it too. The, this also fell out of the box. I'm not too sure what this is yet. I will get back to you on that before the end of the video. But right now, I want to try these eyelashes. And if you notice, I did not put my eyelashes on. <laughs> Normally, I would wear the Sephora lashes. Oh my gosh. But this time, I did not. Oh, can I tell you guys something? So, look. I'm starting to pull it apart, and maybe this is just their error. <gasps> Hold on, I gotta check to make sure this is real. So I'm checking now to make sure it's actually the right amount. So I type in Magify, these are the eyelashes, and look, it's actually 10 for $15.79. I thought it was only gonna be five. So it shows I purchased it on March 16th. And look at that, those are the different styles, which is basically the same style for 15. Easy to apply. And then you have the tweezers it comes with. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so these are supposed to be double eyelid stickers. Hmm, that's interesting. We could try that later. And then more pictures of how the eyelashes are. Let's scroll down to the comments. Let's see. Ooh, looks very pretty. 3D false eyelashes. All right, two styles. Okay, now I get it. So it's 10 pairs with two separate styles. And here are some reviews and videos. Let's see. They do not come with the glue. That's right. Um, yes, they're easy to clean. Okay. All right. So let's get ready to go back and see how these eyelashes look. So yes, guys, as you can see, it is actually 10 pairs for $15 plus the tweezers. Yo, I cannot. Like, this is a really good view. I love this. 
I didn't even realize there was so much stuff that I was actually getting. But now that I have it, let's try some stuff on. All right, so let me see, which one do I wanna put on? I really wanna go glam, so I'm thinking I'm gonna use this one right here. Let's get extra glam, all right? So, oh, I forgot the glue. Let me go get the glue. All righty, so I got the glue, just a regular little eye eyelash glue. And I did say I was gonna try this one. Let's see. I really like these tweezers. They seem pretty easy enough. Can you see? There we go. I really like these tweezers. I feel like they're pretty easy to... Oh, look at that. I just picked them right off, right? And so let's see. The instructions, they actually have instructions in the back too, guys. So it's fully comprehensive. It tells you exactly what to do. It says remove false eyelashes. We did that. Step two, you pinch the ends together and you bend it a little bit. Step three, you compare your own eye type. Okay. And if it's too long, you can use the professional scissors to trim. Mm, do I want to trim? I do not. I like it just the way it is. I like it really long. And then you use the tweezers. So they're actually showing these tweezers. To hold it I'm gonna use these tweezers because I know how to do it with these these are better for me but let's see you apply some of the glue all right you make sure you check your eye out let me get really close so you guys can see and then we're putting there we go we're putting some of the glue on here all right I got it together so we're gonna put just a little bit of glue, right? You can squeeze it directly on, or you can actually choose just to, there we go, to apply it. Maybe you first put it on a brush, and then you apply it. Let's see. All right, smooth it on. You can choose to put it on with the tweezers. The tweezers are fine, but I think I could put this on just like that. And the thing with the eyelashes is that you want to go as close to your eyelash as you can without going on top of it, without destroying it. Basically, you're going like right on top of it, but you're not destroying it. So right there. Seems about good. And you're gonna fix and fix and fix it. All right, we're gonna do this again. Let's see. I put a little bit more glue because I did not have enough the first time. If you have some mascara, that's where you get to blend it in. So you would either get the mascara, or actually it's better to do both. So you get the mascara and you go up. So your eyelashes start to blend with the eyelashes that you put on. And you could also go, alrighty, so you get your mascara if you wanna put on some mascara to really blend it in. And it's part of the glue I'm using too. I just pulled it out of another eyelash pack. I have to find my better glue because obviously this one is not holding. And that's why you don't just get any and any eyelash. Eyelash glue. All right, let's see. You can also go over it with your eyebrow pencil. All right. Thank you. 
then if you want to go above and beyond you can pull these out and really curl them up together all right so i actually went and i got my clear glue because i noticed it was moving way too much and i did not like that so i got my clear glue because the white glue i feel like it just was not sticking it <gasps> And okay, look at this. Now this is so much better. I feel it sticking right away. All right. Curve that piece down there. Ooh, glamour, glamour. All right. So I just got a regular clear glue, a little wet and wild. And where did I put it? Here it is. So yes, if you want to go above and beyond, you don't want it to move, let's see. Is it going to move now? There you go. See, now it's not moving. It's stuck on there. It's like part of my eyes. All right. And that's one side. What do you think? Look at that. You see, look how long those are. Right? See? From this side, you see it? It's like very, very long. Oh uh, yes, I love these. All right, let me put on the other one. All right, so I'm grabbing the other one. And you know what I like? It's that there's so many of them. So, you know, once you take care of your eyelashes and you, let's say you wash them out, you really make sure you soak them overnight and get out all the glue, your eyelashes can last for a long time. That's the only thing I don't like. So it's like five pairs of the same eyelashes and five pairs of the other one. All right, let's see. Here, here. So again, you want to get it close to your eyelashes, but not so close where it's like you're about to pull your eyelashes off. Because the point is not to lose eyelashes, it's just to look as if you have even longer eyelashes. Oh, that one went on, look at this. That one went on so much easier than this one. Anyway, but again, if you want to, I'm gonna leave it for about a few seconds just so that I make sure that it stays on. Look at that, it's like blink, 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 blink. Ooh, so pretty. All right, and then you can use the mascara and push it together. I think I moved it now. It wasn't fully dry. You go with the curvature of your eye. So I, my eye curves a little bit, it's like a little bit almond. And you wanna move with the curve of your eye. And then you can go extra and curl them together. Thumbs up, like, and don't forget to subscribe. New videos every Tuesday and Saturday. It's getting harder to make them twice a week, but I will do them just for you guys. So make sure you subscribe. Oh, and guys, even though I did the video, I'm still gonna make sure I go to my blog, www.badishandbrainy.com, and I will write a written review of the pros, the cons, the recommendations, things that I may have forgotten in the video. It will be up there for you guys to read. Tell me what you think, guys. Bye.